The scholarship recovery project has been launched. The Minister for Labor and Social Security, Winnie Makakula, has also announced a tax team that will lead the scholarship recovery loans. According to the Minister of Labor, Winnie Makakula, the scholarship recovery project began in September 2012, whereby the Ministry of Labor entered into a written contract with a consultant named TransUnion ITC in consortium with Data Network Services P2I Limited and SV Mlala and Associates for the provision of consultancy services. The minister says the consultant was to execute its contractual obligations in two phases. The consultant was also mandated with the determining of how much is owed by individual past beneficiaries. Phase one of the project is complete and yet phase two is near completion. And the ministry has, has seen it fit to implement the third phase of the project, which will entail the actual collection of funds from awarded beneficiaries. It is with this view that the scope of work for the consultant has been increased to reach out to all past beneficiaries inside and outside the country. The ministry is also is of, is of the considered view that increasing the consultant scope of work would be beneficial for government in that it will realize robust collections of the outstanding debts from past scholarship beneficiaries. By extension, this will relieve the financial burden from government and ensure continued sustainability of the noble government initiative of advancing study loans to deserving Swazis to promote pre-service tertiary education in the country. Makakula urges the nation to be cooperative with all parties as they implement this important exercise as it will be beneficial to His Majesty's government and the nation at large. Sidhu Momlala, who spoke on behalf of the consultant, conveyed his appreciation to His Majesty's government for entrusting them with this project. He says, though, it is not a simple task given the amount of work which is involved. Um, I would allude, like to allude to the fact that we, we are aware that, you know, Swazis throughout this period probably were not aware uh, as to what to do and how to manage the issue of um, paying back the, uh, the scholarship. And we, we do believe and would like to believe that um, responsible as they are, Swazis, would like to respond positively uh, by making the necessary commitment. Mzala then appealed to the members of the public to assist them in order for this project to run smoothly. Reporting for Swazi TV News, I'm Zodwa Lamini with Kaliwe Lamini in Babane.